Hi there, welcome to my channel. I have more online jobs that you can do from home. And the ones that I have today all are related to freelance writing. A lot of times people like to write and they feel like they have to create a blog or a website and that turns them off. You don't have to do that. So I'm not even gonna talk about writing a blog and how you can make money with that. It can be lucrative, but maybe that's not what you wanna do. Maybe you just have a certain genre that you wanna um, write for and you're not sure where to go, where to submit your articles and things like that. So I'm gonna give you five different sites today that you can go to if you like to write. And I've done a little bit of research um, and I can tell you how much money you can make per minute um, and per article and things like that. So let's go ahead and get started. The first one is called Cicada. It's a magazine for young adult uh, teens and you could be a young adult or a teen to write for them or not, but that's who they, um, that's who their uh, audience is, the young teens. And basically you can make 25 cents per word up to 9,000 words. So that's like $2,250 for an article. That is for nonfiction. Now, if you're writing fiction, that cost goes down to 10 cents per word, and then there's a limit of 5,000 words, which is still pretty lucrative. And if you like to write poetry, they give you $3 per line if they decide to use your article. So you can see all of that right here, and you can submit your articles. I just typed in cicada.com, and um, they also, um, send you other places that you can sign up with other companies and subscribe with them as well. So they even help you find other companies within that genre. The second genre is this magazine's been around for a long time. It's called Cricket. And Cricket is written for children. I'm going to go all the way down here to the bottom. You can write um, for ages six months to three years, uh, three to six years years old, uh, Spider Magazine, Ladybug. These are all uh, magazines by Cricket. Um, then there's Cricket Magazine itself for nine to 14 year olds and Ask Magazine um, and Muse Magazine, which are more for science for older kids. But you can um, submit anything within those different genres and they pay 25 cents per word if they decide to use your article. So it, with Cricket, you have a little bit more of a variety that you can um, submit your articles to. The next one, if you are into romance, um, there is a site called Heroes and Heartbreakers. Um, so you can go ahead and submit to them. Um, they also cover a little bit of mystery and things like that as well. And they, they are looking for short stories. And basically, if they decide to, to accept your story and pay you for it, they pay you $1,000 up front, and then you get 25% of the royalties from that. So it's a pretty serious um, site. Um, definitely, if you're writing articles for them, you can make some pretty good, pretty good money. Now, maybe you just like to write articles about health and fitness um, or in that kind of industry, the health industry. This one is called Vibrant Life, and they really have a lot of different areas that you can go into with Vibrant Life. They have home exercise recipes, going green. So if you like to write about the environment, if you have a passion for that, family health, mental health, and physical health. So it really covers all areas of health. So you have a lot of different genre, uh, areas within that genre that you can write and submit articles. So it's called Vibrant Life, and Vibrant Life will pay $100 to $300 per article. And then they want their articles to be roughly um, 400 to 650 words. So that's not too bad. They're like little short articles. Um, I think this would be fun if you'd like to write, um, try different recipes. You can send in the pictures and the recipe that you developed. Make sure it's all healthy. Now, also within the health industry, the next magazine, the fifth one, is called Wellbeing. Now, they're more into natural health, so it's a little bit, um, they're more on the natural health side, um, so organic type stuff, and into the environment as well, being green and things like that. But they also pay uh, $500 per article, and as you can see, um, some of the articles here, some of the things that they have in their magazine, you can see right here. So if you're interested in writing for them, um, just like I said, any of those different sites, just go ahead and Google them and it pops right up and you can submit your articles. Um, now, if you're not sure um, about wanting to write specifically articles and things like that, but you like to write and maybe you want to write an ebook or something like that you can still become a freelancer on your own you don't have to go 
through a magazine. But those are, um, if you if you don't want to go out on your own and you feel more comfortable submitting to a magazine, um, you can do it that way. But if you want to be hired for a specific job, there's different sites that you can go to. There's one called Fiverr.com. I'm actually going to put the, um, I'll put that link down there for you. Um, but when you go in here, let's say somebody is looking for um, a writer for a health, let's write a recipe ebook okay now you're on the other end you're one of the people I'm looking to hire so I'm looking for somebody to write a recipe ebook for me so I'm gonna go in here on Fiverr and look for somebody to write this for me and as you can see different people it says I write cookbooks and I start at ten dollars um, over here I can write recipes for your recipe book or cookbook they start at forty five dollars so different people charge different prices and you would just want to go in I'm gonna go in this one here they charge 45 because there's always three different tiers of what they hire and to be honest a lot of times what they advertise is there but then once you contact the person and start telling them what you're looking for um, then they start to bargain with you and then the two of you agree on a price so don't always think that um, what's written here is in concrete or uh, granite because um, you know for five dollars there's not a lot that they can write they might write one recipe for that so again um, if you like to write and you want someone to find you so that you can actually do a job for them and you set your own price then you would want to go through a company like this um, another one is called upwork um, it's the same principle um, they hire you as a freelancer and you can go and you can write articles you can write ebooks um, and things like that you might even want to write articles for other people's blogs so maybe you don't want to take the time to run your own blog and have to do all of that and keep it up but you're fine with writing blogs for other people um, and, and this gives you a little bit more freedom because you can write the article the blog get paid for it and then not take another job until you feel like working if that makes sense but when you have your own blog you pretty much have to keep it up on a regular basis so that's why people might choose not to to run a blog and write for somebody else and then there's another one here called freelancer.com as well so put your name on all three of these sites and hire yourself out as a freelancer where you get to accept the jobs and you get to set the price so you have a little bit more control when you do it like that all right so those are some different ways that you can make money if you enjoy writing now you may not enjoy writing but maybe you like to edit um, you can also find jobs doing that but we're not going to talk about that today but just trying to keep your mind um, looking in all kinds of different directions everybody can find something to do online there's so many thousands of different jobs go ahead and give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if this was something that you enjoyed I do have a playlist that I'm going to put down at the bottom called um, more jobs that you can learn from at home it's a playlist I've got several other videos where I've I try not to duplicate the jobs um, I can't promise you that once in a while I might not duplicate because I can never you know I can't remember all of them but I try really hard to uh, branch out and give you lots of different um, ideas of ways that you can make money without duplicating so go ahead and check out those other videos if you didn't see anything here and you'd like to try something different you're still researching then definitely go into that playlist and check out some other jobs all right thank you for watching